previously on Hell's Kitchen. I'm so sick of this. After another stinging dinner service loss by the men. I feel so low right now, I'm not gonna lie. Can we just let it go for now? Jessica <laughs> gleefully rubbed it in. We schooled them today. I'm gonna keep schooling them. Why try to rub it in and, you know, make you feel worse? And Johnny and the boys went on the attack. Nobody likes you. I thought it's true. They're just being bullies because they're salty that they lost. The next morning. Let's go. Everyone took out their frustrations. Oh, oh, on ostrich eggs. I'm getting so it's yolk in here. Oh, ookie yolk and a lot of it. Which had the names of the ingredients. Whiskey. Kidney beans. Corn. They would use to cook with their cut of ostrich meat. Excellent. Johnny's chipotle chili with an assortment of peppers was a huge disappointment. It's kids food. I'm sorry, guys. But Polly's Asian-themed oyster over rice noodles kept the men in the game. I love it. Finally, a point for the blue team. I win per use. As for the red team, Gia's bland ostrich skewers lacked flavor. No salt, no acidity, no spice. But Wendy nailed her herb and garlic pearl with roasted vegetables. Beautiful meat. And clinched the victory for the red team. Good Thank job. You. I just made my grandma proud of me! At dinner service. 30 seconds on scallops. With some team-wide support. Take a deep breath, OK? Polly rocked the fish station. Service, please. And led the blue team to their first complete service and their first dinner victory. See how easy it flows when we communicate, guys? In the red kitchen, it was mayhem all night. Sorry, chef. Kimberly's overcooked scallops. The scallops are fucked. Put the red team behind. Sorry, chef. Then, after a screw up on meat. Who gave me this? I did. Gia claimed that she suffered an injury. Yeah, I cut my finger off, Chef. Show me. Where's the cut? It's not there. Gia, what the fuck is going on? Then Jessica delivered a mushy pasta tableside. But what's she done? It looked look like a mush. This is nasty. Which was followed by raw salmon and undercooked meat for the same table. Touch them, but it won't bite. The cow's dead. And by then, Chef Ramsay had seen enough. Get out! After service, Gia and Kimberly blamed each other for their horrific service. Are hey, you fucking kidding me? You fucked up the You fucking, fucking scaring you? Why? I'm so fucking hungry. No. The red team ended up only nominating Gia because Jessica unbelievably nominated herself. She has no fight left in her. She's packed. So, for the first time in Hell's Kitchen history, Chef Ramsay sent home a chef who was working tableside ending Jessica's chance of becoming head chef at Yardbird Southern Table and Bar at the Venetian in Las Vegas. And now, the continuation of Hell's Kitchen. Get out of here. These bitches are savages, yo. Are you kidding me? I'm a bitch, I'm hard to work with. Are you fucking kidding me? From here. Yo, I'm hard to work with. Yo, listen. Yo! No, no, no. Yo! This is what happens. There ain't nobody here to be your friend. You gotta bite the bullet and you gotta eat it. Fall you gotta back. put your phony face on and fall back like it ain't nothing. You gotta eat it. You know, I'm not gonna let these bitches see me cry. I'm gonna come back strong. Bet that. You almost just went home. You're right. Exactly. Now that I rest my case. After Gia's late night attitude adjustment from Shayna, all the chefs are up early, where they're greeted by Chef Ramsay. Let's go. 
and a massive display of proteins. As I'm walking into the kitchen, I see all the proteins lined up. I'm just like, what are we going to do? I'm getting excited. Good morning. As you can see behind me, there are some amazing proteins. Now, there is one popular American classic where two proteins share the spotlight, and that is... Surf, surf and turf, chef. I can't hear you. Surf and turf, chef. You're absolutely right. In today's challenge, each team will compete one at a time, and you'll be divided into groups of two. When I say go, the first team will taste the dish, run into the dining room, find those proteins, run back, and place them next to the dish. I am a little worried. My palate is a weak spot for me. If both proteins are wrong, the light will turn red. Both right, green. But if one of your proteins is wrong, the light will turn yellow. Here's the bad news. I am not going to tell you which one is wrong. You'll have to figure that out for yourselves. Oh, no. You're going to have to keep going until you identify the correct two proteins on your dish. The team that identifies the proteins in all four dishes, the fastest, wins the challenge. Pair up, decide your order. Let's go. Let's do this. You know, I'm friends with Ryan, and I trust Ryan's palate. Me and Ryan's You don't want to mix it up? Have two different tastes. I don't think it's going to matter. Really. I'm a little aggravated. Heidi and Ryan kind of was like, well, we're going to go. And I'm like, it's not about being friends at this point. It's about pairing two different people together so we can get the win. You don't want to mix it up, you sure? I'm positive. Shayna, if you don't have a strong palate, you shouldn't be in this competition. You need to go with, like, Aaron. We need the strong with the weak. I know I got a good palate. I mean, I, I took classes on palate tasting. OK, that's Boom. fine. Our strategy now is to put a stronger with a weaker so we can kind of carry each other. Blue team, you worked it out? Yes, yes chef. chef. Good. Fuck off to the dorm. I'll call you back in <laughs> hopefully 10 minutes. Yes, yes chef. chef. Thank you, Chef. Red team, are you ready? Yes, yes chef. chef. Pair number one. Stand in front of the dome, please, because your time starts now. Let's go. Taste, taste, taste. In today's Surf and Turf Identification Challenge, Come on, ladies. Heidi and like Ryan are up first and must correctly identify both proteins that Chef Ramsay has used to make this Surf and Turf dish. Crab cake. Immediately jumps to my head is crab cake. That's not quite crab, though. But I've learned in Hell's Kitchen it's never that simple. I have no shrimp. 25 seconds gone, Ryan. Let's go, ladies. Come on, ladies, let's go. Look for white meat. Get the chicken. Come on. As soon as I saw their plate, I knew what it was. Let's go with simplicity first. Get the chicken. I have a chicken. Chicken, OK. Did you see shrimp? Faster, guys, huh? Shout out. Shrimp. Chicken. Uh, one oh, is wrong. That's not one shrimp. Is wrong. shrimp. Let's grab that turkey. Okay. Come on, ladies. Come on, Come on ladies. Come on, ladies. Come on, ladies. Come on. Turkey and shrimp. Wrong. Come on. Go back. Get the chicken. It's a bird, it's a bird. Let's go with chicken already. Chicken's right here. No, we already put out chicken. Okay. Get the chicken. Shayna should shut up. It wasn't chicken. <laughs> Cornish game hen and shrimp. Wrong, keep going. Come on. Get, Get the chicken. chicken. They got the chicken already. So apparently, Shayna eats a lot of chicken. Any you need shrimp? Correct. Yeah. Well done. Yes. Let's go. Taste, taste, taste. Under, 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 Come on. Come on, ladies. All right, go for the protein. I got the fish. Two and a half minutes gone. Uh, I have a really, really great palate. It's base scale. I think it's just one of my gifts. It's not, it's not beef. Chia and I did have a falling out last night, and I won't forget it, but I can forgive for today and hopefully help our team win. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Elf. Go for the elf. Good. Uh, sorry for, no, it's not sorry for. Come Elf. on, come on, come on, yeah, go yes, speed yes, up. Yes. Go, 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 go. Elf and buffalo, chef. One's wrong. Elf, try elf. Come on, run. Round. Shout out. Elf and elf. It's your game, baby. Four minutes gone. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait for me. Venison. Venison and scale, chef. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, Z. Two proteins. Let's go. Jesus. It sort of, kind of has that ostrich bland taste. It's definitely a red meat. Uh, right here, right here. Five minutes down. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Ostrich and scale. Wrong. Lobster and beef. Wrong. Come on, ladies. When you're up there, your eyeballs are moving so fast because you're trying to get things right. Come on, ladies. Uh, Cod and go. Wrong. Swarf and Bill and Swarf. Wrong. Elf and Frontlet. No. Come back and taste it. Come back and look at it. Come on, ladies. Is it for the love of God? Hold it up and let us see it. 
Halibut in buffalo. Oh, come on. Grab something. Octopus and trout. Surf and surf? One, One is right. right. One is right. The dish is surf and surf. Where the fuck is the turf? Let's go elk again. That's the second time you've done an elk. Bacon, Bacon octopus. octopus. Wrong. Rabbit octopus. Wrong. I didn't think that their pelts were that bad. I was wrong. We did kangaroo, we did buffalo, we did lamb. We touch damn near every meat that can be brown. What about this? Hurry up! Squab and octopus. Yes! Yeah! Yeah! Go! Squab? I don't know what squab is. I never even heard of it. What were you doing? Well, I'm gonna research that. I'm a research squab. I'm gonna Google it. After Shayna and Aziza take nearly eight minutes to identify their proteins, it's up to the last team, Heather okay, and Wendy, to make up lost time. Yes! I might taste the meat, taste the meat. It kind of looks like lobster and a filet mignon. It looks like true surf and turf. Go, 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 Try monkfish. Try I got fish. the lady monk swordfish. Fish. Monkfish. Here. Monk. Go, 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 go. Help, monkfish. One right. Buffalo and monkfish, chef. Yeah! Fuck yeah! yeah. yeah. <laughs> well done. Woo! Yeah! Shay and Z's took up so much time, really hoping for an act of God to stop them from winning this challenge. Gentlemen. Let me show you the time you have to beat. 13, 13. minutes, 41 seconds. <laughs> That's a long ass time. Pair number one, your time starts now. Don't. With the clock counting down from the women's time, Polly and Johnny started off for the men. Looks like a crepe cake and some kind of chicken. Tastes like turkey. Interesting. Go, run, run! Turkey, turkey, turkey. Crab, 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 crab. I don't think that's crab. Guys, it's not a crab cake. It's way too easy. Chef Ramsey's trying to trick us. It looks like a crab cake. That's why it's not crab. All right, it's not so crab. not crab. Let's do something different here. It's definitely turkey. Turkey, shrimp. shrimp. One right. right. Take the shrimp back. Take the shrimp. We got this. Turkey, turkey halibut. halibut. Wrong. Oh, both wrong, both, both wrong. Right. So the turkey was wrong, the shrimp are back. How can that not be turkey? Grab the shrimp. Stay with the white meat, gentlemen. White. Shrimp, game, game hand. One right. <sighs> we got the foul over here, too. Yeah, the go foul. 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 Great, I got it. Oh, it's gotta be one of these freaking birds up here. Shrimp, shrimp foul. Yes. Yes. Go. Go, 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 go. Cut that burger in half, let's yep. see it. What's it look like on the uh, inside? Tough, it's okay. game it's meat. game meat, baby. Don't eat the fucking macaroni. Don't eat the macaroni. It looks like a scallop. It, it looks, looks like a scallop. fucking scallop. Yeah. Scallop, baby, scallop. Scallop. Come on. They're venison. Venison, uh, elk, I got moose. venison. Venison. Go venison. Yeah. Go, 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 go venison. Scallop, scallop, venison. Scallop, venison. Oh, Let's do yeah, it. Baby. First try, are you kidding me? I mean, I'm not saying anything, but damn, we knocked that out the park. All right, on, hey, guys. cut that down. Cut that down. Let's see it. Let's see it. It looks chewy. All I see is dark meat skewers and rice. It's really, really lean. lean. It could be, it could be another game. Elk is very lean. The other protein kind of sticks out like a sore thumb. It's got a dark red ring and it's white in the center. This shit's octopus. Octopus, octopus, octopus. Yep, that's what go, I'm looking go, for. Go, go, go. Octopus, kangaroo. One's right, get the octopus. Right. Keep the octopus. We're hunting for red meat now. Octopus, octopus elk. elk. One right. Come on, Coop. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Octopus, ostrich. No. Fuck, go, run. They don't know what squab is either. What the hell is a squab? Octopus lamb. No. Fuck. Come on. Clams of veal. ostrich. I'm winded as fuck. I may look like I'm fit, but I'm out of shape. I run when chased or run to the refrigerator and back. Who did lamb? Do a squab. Who's Go say, come, on. come on. Come on, just go with this. God damn it. Octopus squab. Yeah. Let's go. Finally. With an uneven number of chefs on the blue team, Holly has volunteered to go twice, pairing up with Matt for the final round. Obviously, lobster tail. That's a flay. Filet. That's a flay. Filet and lobster tail, right? Let's go. All right. Yeah, but that can't be hold lobster. On, hold on. That's hold not on. lobster. That's not lobster. They're fucking with you. Swordfish. Swordfish. Beef. beef. No. Go, go, go. Pull that lobster tail out. Good idea to taste. Yep. Piece of fish. That looks like macro. 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 Yes. Please let them take five minutes trying to figure this out. Try the buffalo. Grab halibut. Halibut. Hurt. Buffalo. Oh, halibut. halibut. One right. Leave halibut. No, that's not halibut. No, it's not. that's not halibut. Elk. Halibut. Elk. Elk. Halibut. 
Why is nobody listening to me? I know they can hear me. Get Buffalo. We know it's Buffalo, and now I'm going to find seafood. Come on, let's go. Buffalo. It's sea not bass. sea bass. It doesn't look like that. Yes. Yes. OK, come on, boys. Yeah, keep bringing up the wrong fish. Monkfish. Where's next fish? Where's monkfish? Tilapia. Tilapia here. Buffalo. Tilapia. Uh, no. Buffalo trout. No. Buffalo snapper. No. Buffalo cod. No. no. Grab, grab the, the fish. Mackerel, like, mackerel, Aaron keeps saying. like I've said. Time's ticking, guys. Where's the mackerel? Where's the mackerel? Guys, it's a white it's fish. It's the fish that's, that's right in the middle. Of top apart. row. Polly, straight ahead. There's yes. Trout. No. There's trout. No, top top row. Row. Listen to me. Grab something. Grab a fish and come back. Pick something and go, Polly. Come on. No. Pick something. That looks like mackerel. Mackerel. Buffalo swordfish. Oh. No. Come on. Oh, right there, right, right there. there. Grab that fish right there. I'm like, please don't see the monkfish. Please don't see the monkfish. Please. Come on, guys. It's a white fish. Guys. Just come on. Hey, come on. Hey, what is that? Buffalo. Oh, monkfish. monkfish. Yep. Yes. Right there. Yes. Oh, oh, yes. Ah. Ah. We did it. Not Shots finished. Don't finish. Shot gone. Blue team. team. All of you are heading down the coast to San Diego. Yeah! While there, all of you are going to be surfing. Oh! I, my on that oh! I have never been surfing before. It's like I just hit a scratch off or something, like hitting the lottery. This is fucking amazing. Yeah, but just to make sure you catch that perfect wave, I'm sending you to the Wave House. Oh! This place is unique. It has the best artificial waves in the US. <laughs> Say goodbye to the ladies. Bye, Bye ladies. <laughs> well done. Woo! Thank you, Take Tyler. Take care. Zips up. Ladies, while the blue team are enjoying the surf, you are all going to be up to your necks in the turf because you're going to be spending all day making the most delicious sausages from scratch. And Chef Andy is going to prepare a very special lunch. Oh, no. Off you go. Thank you, Chef. Damn. I'm not eating it. I'm so frustrated. Why didn't anybody listen to me when I said to break Heidi and Ryan's group up? When I made the teams, when I was trying to help Jay, it out. It wasn't about that. This it was about moving fast. That was all it was. Listen, you can't go with your fucking best friend. No. That's not going to work. It was I'm not. telling you, me and Aziza don't have the good palates. Why, why, why you think I put it wasn't G and about Kim. together? It wasn't about palates. It was about moving. I didn't know that, what that Come fucking. On. I didn't know what that protein was. It was, it was about a moving. a palate challenge. Watching these girls, you know, blow it and then blame me when I got our team off to a great start, it, it really pisses me off specifically say, oh, I don't think that us two should go together. It was about hustling. That's Whatever. why we lost. Whatever. Hustle my ass. Ugh. Is it going down? I hate you, sausage. This punishment sucks. Making sausage till the sun comes up. The boys are out surfing, having four-star lunch. I'm here packing up a pig, grinding them down, and making sausage. Ready? Yes. I love like bratwurst, really good German, like you love like the it. German sausage. Beard. Yeah, I'm Italian. We do sausage seriously here. Ready? Oh, yeah. Churning and making our own sausage is just a lot of work. But I guess a good sausage, you're putting love into it, and hard work and love kind of coincide. Yeah, you know, I just need a little more meat. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Good. Hold on. Stop, stop, stop. Yeah. Go, go, go. Just a little more squeeze. Is that a good size? <laughs> We call it sausage back home. Yay, yo, bravo! Check out his sausage. Whoa, that is a beautiful looking sausage, if I do say so myself. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Welcome to the Wave House, guys. You guys excited to ride? Yeah! Has anyone done this before? No! Awesome, yeah. We'll have you hop on the way. All right. Sounds good? Yeah! yeah. Let's, let's, let's get it! Let's get it! I'm so ready to go surfing. The guy made it look pretty easy. Why can't I do it? So bend your knees. I've got long hair. This hair is built for boards. Brah. Oh. <laughs> Damn, that looks like that hurts. Oh. 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 Ha, 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 ha!
I watched all these other guys bust their ass. I'm out there riding the wave in California. Woo! Little old Devin from the East Coast. He can surf. to eat whatever's in front of you, OK? OK. I don't know, and I don't want to know. I got the pig feet. Is that a spider? Oh, my god. It's a tarantula. Oh, yeah. I'm deathly afraid of big brown spiders. You got it. There you go. Just furry and brown and crunchy. Ah! I think I have testicles. Yeah, those look like testicles. Can I get some hot sauce? Are your balls raw? No, they're actually steamed quite nicely. They're nice and soft. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's actually quite nice, the texture. Oh, my god. <laughs> it wasn't bad. I kind of liked it. Mmm, yummy. <laughs> I got more of that sauce. <laughs> so what's your new game plan? Just uh, single one out and get them off? Single one out and make her cry. We you pick Jessica, then they lost, and Jessica went out. Nobody's talking to you. I don't know why you even fucking look at me. Like, just stop talking to me. Nobody likes you. That's not true. That's not true. Next week, it's like, I'm thinking, Kim. <laughs> that voice, oh my god, it's the worst. I'm gonna rip her up right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is the exact kind of, like, stuff I do. I just can't wait to make her cry. All right, rat face. I have a rat face? Go chew on some cheese, rat. Whatever. Yo, Splinter, shut your rat face. Fuck you, Johnny. Go Fuck join you. Jess. <laughs> the blue team is pathetic. These guys are sheep. I am a wolf, and I will bite back. You can call me whatever the fuck you want. Because hey, at the end of the day, I outcooked your It's the end of the ass. day, Splinter. Why don't you start acting like a gentleman and be respectful to people and stop trying to rip on people because you feel fucking shitty about yourself? You think you're going to be here longer than him? You know what? I'm going to leave. No, no, it's a question. I'm not... Do you think you're going to be here longer than him? <laughs> it's my mission. What? It's, well, guess what? Mission unsuccessful. Yeah. Go back in your rat's nest, Splinter. With the doors to Hell's Kitchen just a few hours away from opening. Start strong, finish strong, baby. Yeah, buddy. The blue team hopes to keep their winning streak alive. Everybody feeling good? Everybody feeling confident? We're going to win this? While the red team looks to regain some momentum. Ladies, good afternoon. good afternoon. Good afternoon, Chef. Gentlemen, line up, please. We have a VIP 12 top tonight. I've decided to split that into two sixes, but we'll treat it as a 12 top. Yes, Chef. Yes, chef. So tonight, don't overthink it. Just cook with confidence. What are we going to do tonight? Cook, cook with confidence. confidence. I can't hear you. Cook with confidence. We turn around and tell each other. Cook, cook with confidence. Good. Get on your stations. Yes. Yes, yes, chef. yes, Chef. Let's go. Uh, Marina. Si. Open up Hell's Kitchen, please. Let's go. As the dining room quickly fills up, Cheers, y'all. Orders are already being placed. The pan suit scallop sounds great. I love a record blend. And the party of 12 friends from a birthing class have arrived. I'll be back in a couple of minutes if you have any questions uh, regarding the menus, OK? There you go. You're welcome. In addition to the classic menu, the carbonara. Tonight, Chef Ramsay will be offering a special mussel and sausage appetizer. So olive oil, shallot, and garlic. To be served tableside yeah. by Wendy for the red kitchen and Devin for the blue kitchen. I order four kilos, number 43. Two scallops, one risotto. Yes, yes chef. chef. Let's go. Yes, chef. Heard, Chef. Z, I'll let you know when I'm like four minutes out for the scallop. Heard? Heard. You're doing great. I'm trying. It is super hard to be away from my little guy right now. But, you know, at the end of the day, I'm here to make our lives better. Ladies, I'm five minutes out with risotto, OK? Z, five and a half. Heard, OK. How long for the risotto? Five minutes, Chef. But the scallops are ready when she turns them. Oh, man. Fucking hell. Oh, my god. Look what we're doing. I've got more fat in this pan than I have in my fryers. <laughs> oh, man. I start all over, Chef. I'll fix it, Chef, and I won't do it again. I don't want deep-fried scallops. You won't get them, Chef. 
while the red team tries to recover from Aziza not only starting the scallops too soon, but deep frying them as well. In the blue kitchen, Johnny and Andrew on appetizers, start off strong right now, and Coop on fish, are determined to get the blue team off on the right foot. One kale salad, two risotto. All right, all right, all right. Let's go. You want to do kale salad? Yep, I got the, the kale salad. You got the risottos. That's what we're going to do. We've won our challenge, and we're going to take that into dinner service. There's nothing that's going to stand in our way right now. Two risotto, how long? 30 seconds on risotto. 30. Thank you. I'm tossing salad now. Taste, Johnny. Let's go, Johnny. Walking. Walking with risotto. Kale salad right here, chef. Let's go, Coop. Come on. Walking lobster. Heard walking lobster. I'm going to rock fish. I don't think there's a protein on this station I've never cooked before, so I know blue team's going to kill it. Oh, my Wait. god. Fuck you. Hey, blue team, come here. Blue team, come here. Touch that. Cold, chef. Cold, chef. Cold, chef. It's not even warm. It's just ice cold. Ice cold lobster. Fucking hell. Let's go fix come it. Come get it out. Right, right, fix <laughs> Give me 30 seconds. This is ridiculous, man. That's the very first ticket. Come on, man. Walking lobster. Hey, uh. Very nice, that risotto. Service, please. We got it out. We can come back. We're, go we're gonna be fine. Now that Coop has bounced back quickly. Service, please. Appetizers are now making their way out to satisfied blue diners. Mm, that's great. That's that's really good. Meanwhile, the red team is hoping Aziza has got her act together. Pull the scalps, Steve. Pull the scalps. Get your scalps pull them. out. So that they can push out appetizers. Risotto walking. Let's go, guys. Scallop risotto, yeah. Chef coming in. Yes. Very nice, the scallops. Very nice. If I wasn't trying to add deep fried scallops to the menu, it was a mistake, and I'll never do it again. Pinky promise. Come on, you got it. With a couple of setbacks behind them. Get it, girl. Appetizers are now flowing out of both kitchens. That's good. And both teams are ready for entrees. Half the 12 top, yes? Yes, yes chef. chef. Half the table, they're pregnant, OK? So please be careful, yes? Well, I know how pregnant bitches are. I used to be pregnant. I always wanted my food fast, because I was always fucking hungry. Here we go, ladies. Entree to Salmon to Wellington to New York Strip. Yes, Chef. Yes, chef. Here we go, blue team, six top, yes, half the 12 top. Be careful, half the table's pregnant as well. Entree to Salmon to Seabass to Wellington. Six minutes to the window, yes? Yes, yes chef. Yes, chef. With entrees for the 12 top split between both kitchens, timing is critical, as Chef Ramsay expects to deliver all the dishes at the same time. How long on the garnish? Yo. Gia, how much time do you need? Where is my thing? My thing. How much time do you need, Gia? Gia! I'm topping it now. Two minutes. Gia, snap out of it. Get your head into the game. Ladies. Yes, yes chef. chef. Is the salmon ready? Yes. Are the Wellingtons ready? Yes, yes chef. chef. What are we waiting for? The gun. The fish and meat are ready, but we're waiting on the garnish. Yes, yes, yes chef. chef. God, fuck. Having to wait on garnish is like a fucking sin. Excuse me. Fuck. Man. Where's she going? She burned some, chef, I think. You burned the potatoes? No, I put currants in them instead of capers, chef. God, Who told you to put currants in there? Nobody, chef. Nobody, nobody. I got a million shit going on in my head, Ramsey. You understand? Give me a minute to absorb this shit. Fucking hell. Oh, my God. Like, leave me the fuck alone. While Gia tries to catch up with the rest of her kitchen. Baby's hungry. Yeah. Baby's letting me know baby's tell. hungry. The pregnant ladies and their guests are starting to get a little impatient. But back in the blue kitchen. Are you guys ready? Two sea bass and two salmon. Ready to walk? The men are almost ready with their half of the ticket. I'm walking with your sauce. Garnish is in the window for two salmon and two Wellington. Two Wellingtons. All right, you just have to count them. Two sea bass going right now. Two salmon's right there. Right. Two salmon to the window. Let's go, blue team. Let's get it go. We got this. Hey, hey, blue team. Yes, chef. Yeah, that's you. Yeah, he'll move. Move! Don't worry about the sauce. The fucking salmon's raw. still raw. Put your finger in there. It's raw. There is no sushi on the menu! I've got a table of pregnant ladies out there now that don't like hanging around, feeling uncomfortable in restaurants. Baby's hungry, yeah. At this pace, one of them's going to give birth soon. Do you need me to come over here and cook that fish? No. I lost my job to come out here. I go home to no job. So it's time to buckle down and fucking fight back. 
while Coop tries to recover quickly from the mishap with the salmon. Back in the red kitchen... Walking with garnish for Wellington and salmon. Gia is finally delivering garnish for the 12 top. Green beans. That one's burnt. Ladies, so I've got three beans, four beans, I got four and a half beans I per portion. Wasn't enough. Sorry, no. Chef. You can't even cook green beans. Gia sinking tonight like the Titanic on that cold winter's day. Hey, and you're not even listening. I am very much. Okay, listening. Well, let me just tell you something in plain English. They're saturated in butter. They're overcooked, and you're missing about one and a half portions. Hey. Hey, when you throw your arms in the air like that, what's all that for? No, what I'm trying, I'm trying to say that I'm M answer, I'm M focused, you I'm are. listening. That's my New York kid. These are my New York. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you really fucking kidding me? Let's go then, pick it up. With both kitchens at a log jam because of the 12 top, no food is leaving either kitchen. And the next delivery may not be an entree. Hey, and I don't know if you noticed, but there's nothing coming out your kitchen. Yes, chef. It's all deflated. Yes, chef. She's given up. It's flat. Never given up. There's no drive. Never given up. I can't even Never get green up. beans nope. out. You've got to fucking speed up. Yes, I swear to God. Gia is doing everything wrong, and it's really hard to watch. I hop up and garnish, and I'm doing as much as I can to kind of try and keep our keep our groove going. Yo, he's fucking riding me for no fucking reason, yo. Keep it together. Like, he just keeps picking on me. Like, he's fucking alone. Just keep it together. You walking with salmon? Walking with salmon garnish. With Ryan stepping in on garnish. Ryan. Yes, chef. Well done. Service, please. The red team's entrees are served to their half of the VIP table. <laughs> you get <getting> hungry, too. <laughs> While the other half waits on the blue team. How long? One minute, chef. Okay, let him rest, let him rest. I just want to put one dish out where he doesn't say anything, he just puts it in the window and it goes, just, just once. You're good, you're good. We're ready to walk, done. Coming up now, go. The cook one, the cook, the cook, okay, finally. That's his 12 top, yes? Yes, Chef. Aaron, nicely cooked the New York strip. Thank you, Chef. Ding. With Aaron and the rest of the blue team delivering their share of the entrees. Service, please. The 12 top has now been completed. Good. Walking with Wellington. Walking with potatoes. Come on, ladies, we got it, we got it. And both teams are now sending a steady stream of entrees out of the kitchen. Last table to see us to Wellington. Yes, yes, chef. Chef. Start strong, finish strong, let's go. As yes. soon as you put this food up, time yourselves out, yeah? We are going to complete this service. Go, go, go with Wellington, come on. There was no way I was going to let these guys go down. How long? Four minutes, Chef. He said four minutes, so you four say minutes, four. Kid, you four go. minutes. There we go. Hey, has he found his voice yet? Nope, he's getting there, though. you got to talk. I'm ready on Seabest. You take yours. So how long for your Wellington? Come on, Aaron. He's standing there like the Statue of Liberty. Turn the timer off. Or is that your alarm clock to wake you up? No, that's my timer, Chef. Aaron looks like a little scared bunny rabbit. Girl pair of balls. This is Hell's Kitchen. Garnish is up, let's go. Walking, walking, walking. See best chef on your right. Where's the Wellington? They're cold in the middle, they're cold in the middle. Bring me the Wellington. I tried. I begged. Look at, look at the state of it. Sliced too early, reheated. But then look at this. Darn. Overdone. Bitch, what is going on in here? Get out. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Come on. Get out. And it sucks losing. It sucks to bust my ass and still end up with a loss. I am fucking done. I've never seen such disarray. And every ticket's been a battle. Fuck off to the dorm. Have a fucking good chat and come up with two nominees. Again, your sport for choice. Get out. Last table. While the men, once again, take that long walk of shame, the women are hurrying to push out their last ticket. Coming up with Wellingtons. Wellingtons walking. All right, coming up with varnish. Where's the lamb? Right here. Lamb is coming, Chef. Perfectly cooked lamb. Service, please. Ladies, clear down. Well done. I'm glad that the red team is finishing service because I know if we would have lost, you know what? Y'all would have found some fucking way to blame me. What happened on fish? I fucked up my times. I knew fish station. You have a timing. You were throwing a raw fish. It, that was it. I wasn't ready for it. 
period. Who goes up? I know it's gonna be me. You got it. I understand the situation. I understand my fuck ups, but I'm not gonna freak out because I'll be able to win over Chef Ramsay and I'll keep my place in this house. Who goes up with him? It's Aaron and Coop for me. I don't think so, I'm not going that way. He's did great tonight. And it's like, he did not do great tonight. But he didn't, no, he yes, didn't he do, did. He didn't yes, do he did. Though. I felt like we had to shadow you so much tonight. But at the I'm end of the day, of he didn't have one refire. Everyone else who's yes, working he did. The, the Wellington, that was, no, but, that was the straw. They want the vote Aaron for elimination. Aaron did a fabulous job tonight. How does that make any sense? Okay, you can cook a piece of meat, but you can't tell anybody what you're doing? That's the whole thing. You can't That's communicate the, the chef? You know, I think it's fucking bullshit, you know? There you I, go. I was on nomination, and I stepped it the fuck up tonight. He didn't touch any of my meat. I don't know what the hell is going through the blue team's mind right now to, to nominate me. I, I don't deserve this. I don't want to put Aaron up tonight. Who would you put up? I'd rather it be Devin going up. Devin's slipping through the cracks. He's out of his league. You know, we're in the NBA, he's still in the D-League. He just doesn't get it. Aaron, who do you want to vote for? Devin. What the fuck, dude? Really, Aaron? All I heard was you getting yelled at. Voice, voice, voice. I've been in the dining room all night while you are fucking up and not communicating in the kitchen. This is a really tough choice. It's a fucking stupid tough choice. It's horrible that one of you has to go. I don't want anybody going, I don't. Wow, wasn't exactly our best performing service, was it? No, no chef. chef. Blue team, have you reached the consensus? Yes, yes chef. chef. Good. Was it difficult? Yes, yes chef. chef. Uh, Johnny, blue team's first nominee and why? First nominee is Coop, chef. He uh, had trouble putting out fish, and that was where all the problems seemed to have started. Uh, blue team's second nominee and why? Second nominee, chef, is Aaron. Although he did have a couple nice pieces of meat, we consistently have to hold his hand. Coop, Aaron, step forward. Coop, why do you think you should stay in Hell's Kitchen, Coop? I love this. This is exactly where I want to be. This is what I want to do. Yes, I have fucked up. Yes, I admit that. You can only take me at my word, but I will never fuck up like that again. Not once, I promise. Are you? better than Aaron. Absolutely, Chef. I am better than Aaron. His temperatures were spot on tonight. His temperatures were spot on tonight with the help of other cooks. What does that mean? Somebody else cooked them for him? They did not cook them, but before they went to the pass, he got extra help to guarantee that they were correct. Is that true, Aaron? Uh, yes, I asked Andrew to double check my meat, because, you know, I don't want it to get sent back, because that would, you know, that. Aaron, why do you think you should stay in Hell's Kitchen? I think I should stay in Hell's Kitchen because, you know, I, I've improved since, you know, when I was on the chopping block last time. I've improved immensely. And the only thing I need to work on right now is communication. I need to find my voice more. How long am I supposed to wait? I, I'm not sure what, what I'm, you know, what, I'm not sure. <sighs> Aaron. Yes, yeah, Chef. You can cook. Thank you, Chef. But your lack of confidence may be your undoing. The person leaving Hell's Kitchen is. Gia. Stand up, young lady. And come over here. And let me tell you something. You were already on thin ice coming to this service. Your brigade, your team, have lost faith in you. You are not ready to step in to the Venetian Hotel in Las Vegas. Wow. I'm in shock. I don't even know what happened. I don't know why I'm standing here. I'm not happy to be leaving under these circumstances. I think somebody else deserves to be out here. Who? I don't give a fuck, but I wasn't up for elimination. So the person that was up for elimination should be out here. Coop, get your act together quickly. Yes, I will, Chef. Back in line. Thank you, Chef. Aaron. Yes, Chef. Get your head out the sand and start fucking communicating. Yes, Chef. Back in line. Ladies. Yes, Chef. Yes, Chef. I've just done you all a favor. Get out of here. I'm 
gland that Gina's got, she was like a big cancer on your face. And we finally got it removed. Now we can all be shining pretty again and do a great job. Are you fucking kidding me? Fucking dodged a bullet right there. Holy shit. I'm ecstatic, but I really got to step my game up. I really got to be more vocal. Can you hear me now? You just got to get out of jail free card. This is my life. This is what I want. Now is the time to fight back and prove my place, and I will. I gave Gia a second chance, which proved to be two chances too many. See you, Gia. Next up on Hell's Kitchen. Who do you think you can take down? When Chef Ramsay has the chefs call each other out. I'll take Matt. Kim, I was waiting to see who had enough balls to pick me. I got this done. Will Andrew's head get so big? It can't be contained. Let's go, guys. Don't ever cook them. Andrew talks so much shit of how he's so good. Or will anyone be able to burst his bubble? Just get fed, John. Stop yelling, man. What the fuck? And when the teams get some last minute surprise diners. Oh, my God. Definitely one of my heroes. Hi. Up in Maine, we don't see a lot of superstars. Will the chefs be able to hold it together? <laughs> Wake up. I am freaking out a little bit. Or will they lose their minds during service? Hello, Ryan. On a stage, Chef? No, Ryan, on the bus. All next time on a swashbuckling. Yar, matey! And mind shattering. Bro! Oh, fuck. Episode of Hell's Kitchen. <laughs>